All right, welcome back everyone to another video. Uh, today we're gonna do some more walk-off wax. Today is the Mega Box, or the Mega Blaster. It's nine great packs, six current, three wax, plus two autos or relic, or a graded star or rookie guaranteed. Couldn't tell you what's inside here right now, but I've opened up some of the small blaster boxes and I've been pretty happy so far, so. Thanks again for Walk Off Wax for producing this box. I am not a, uh, I am not getting paid to say this. So, so far, I have been pretty happy with their product. I haven't seen a bunch of bad reviews yet, but it's a pretty new product. So, here we go. Nine packs. See a bunch in there. Should we take them out one at a time and open them as we go? So here's a hit. Hard to tell what's going on in there. Oh, another hit. Hard to tell what's going on in there. First pack. Oh, look at that. 2020 Bowman. One of the most elusive sets. This is retail, so 2020 Bowman. Here we go. Yu Chang's rookie, that's nice. Tim Anderson, Whit Merrifield, Chisholm, John Diaz, first Bowman, Bryson Scott, Matt Manning, Bryce Terang, Chrome, Glaber, and Buster. So, no super big hits in that one. Always nice to open up some 2020 Bowman though. All right, next pack. Uh, the Living Legend Pete Rose set. That's funny. Is there an autograph on one of these? So yes, there is a Living Legend set from Pete Rose. What year are these cards? These are 2012. Never opened any of these Pete Rose. I like that card. How about that? Bends over as he heads a local newspaper while waiting his turn to practice. Oh, he's reading it. That's cool. Tell you what, he should make it in the Hall of Fame. I understand he's had some controversy, but this guy right here is an actual batting goat. You can hardly get anything past him. He, he knows what you're going to throw before you throw it. So that was the Living Legend set. <clears throat> 94 Series 2. Wow, that's old. A little bricked up. So we'll go ahead and crack it up a little bit. Tops gold card in every pack. Special top black gold and tops finest. Randomly inserted. Here are some odds. So I did, when I was a child, open up a bunch of this. But I know that they are bricked. Here's a coming attraction. Little bit of paper loss. A little bit of paper loss in that one. Ed Sprague. Gary Gaetti. Lou Whitaker. Bob Scanlon. Ooh. A little crunchy on his packs, but... Oh, Glavin. He's turned backwards for some... Oh, look. The Glavin is the gold. Oh, there is paper loss. See that? A little bit of paper loss, but our gold in here was a... Was it uh, Tom Glavin? Kind of disappointed in the paper loss, but these are the vintage packs, I'd say. Classic wax packs, so it's kind of what you get at these, at this year. Eckersley. A little paper loss. Steve Sachs. And 
and a Kevin Ramier. So nothing crazy there, Glavin, but it did have a little bit of surface issues. But that was our classic. Let's keep on a moving. So here's our last classic. It is the 89 set. 89 Donruss, oh Bowman, sorry, these are the big, bigger cards. Yuck. So 89. Look at that. So that's a Mickey Mantle, just a good you know card, but anything Mickey Mantle, I'm probably just going to go ahead and keep. These are definitely larger than your standard card. A lot of people did not like this set because of this reason. See how much taller they are? Widths are the same. Definitely a taller card though. So cool Mickey. Uh, Dave Henderson, I knew I knew that. These gonna be a little harder to young blood. Yep, Joel Youngblood, Paul Ossenmacher, Frank Tanana, Wesley something, Gardner, Gary Sheffield. It's a young looking photo of him. Angels, White Sox. Ron Kittle, Chuck Finley, uh, Juan Bell, hmm. Hugh Walker, Don Hinkle, and Tom Lawless. So I haven't heard very many of them, but nice to go. There's some nostalgia there. All right, let's keep on moving. So we're four packs in. I think we got our three waxes out of the way. Well, it looks like we got a Series 2 hobby pack. 2020 Series 2. Nice getting a hobby. Let's see what we can get out of there. Such, Rookie, Sheffield. Daddy, Daza, Marvel, Diaz, Tuvalua, Wick, Luis Robert. How about that? One pack, and we'll pull his auto. Or not his auto, his uh, base. Little corner damage down there, it looks like. But a nice... Luis Robert, standard print. Cole Tucker, Stallmount. Pretty cool hedges, significant statistics card. Never seen the yellow around it, but it is part of that insert set. Let's set that aside. James McCann and Tom Eshelman. So I'll take that, Robert. So nice hit there. Let's keep on rolling. Oh, we got Alan Ginter hobby. Pretty cool. 2020 Alan Ginter. Nice judge on the back. So we have a Christian Yelich, Carlton Fisk, McMahon, Harmon Killebrew, Didi Gregorius, Tony Lasorda, and got Bugging Out, Praying Mantis, and a nice judge long ball. Didn't notice any 
any variations in any of these yet. So, so no major hits yet, but a lot of fun looking at this. Next, looks like we got 2020 long stem. This must be retail for nine cards. Oh yeah, there we go. Where does he get these from? I don't know, five bucks for this pack. A little rough. Brian Henderson, so 2020 Heritage. Chris Davis, Brad Keller, Noma Zaria, Pete Alonzo, Zach Eflin, Justin Turner, Nola, Kyle Lewis, there we go. Take that. Go and sleeve the Lewis. I don't think I have this one. Gotta make sure I check on completing the set to see if I get to put this one in my PC or not. There we go. So out of that, Kyle Lewis. Check the backs real quick sometimes. So, this 457 is a, I believe, a short or a variation. So, possibly, could be wrong. Pretty sure it is, though. All right, so a nice Kyle Lewis there. So, we're getting some pretty good 2020 rookies. We should have two packs left to make our nine, right? Nine great packs. So, Hobby 2019 Big League. Mm. Okay, well, it's a hobby pack, so there are some pretty good odds when you start stepping up into the hobbies. Here are your odds there. All right, big league. Josh Hader, Lorenzo Cain, Joey Gallo, Nick Castellanos, Ronald Acuna, Wall Climber. I like that card. So there is an insert set for this wall climber set. I'm sure, Trout will be found in that set because he likes to climb the wall. Nice yellow. It's normal yellow. Yellow card. Must be some kind of a parallel there. I'll take a yellowish parallel. I would assume this is just a yellow parallel. I don't see any numbers or anything. Any stamping other than the 398 standard number. Arietta, Hernandez, Kendrick, and Mikel Franco. All right, that should be the last pack pulling out. We'll see what we get. And then we got our two hit packages up here. Don't let me forget that. So that should have cleared out our walk-off wax box. We have a 2019 Diamond Kings. Personally, I don't see enough Diamond Kings. I like the set. Hard to find. When you do get blasters, not very many of them come in the set. So it's kind of kind of hard to get into it when there's not a ton of cards. All right, 2019 Diamond Kings. Mel Ott. We have a black border. So I had one of these the other day. I think that's the difference. So a black border back is going to be a variation of some sort. That's why it was backwards. Correct me if I'm wrong, friends. This should be a variation. I'm going to go ahead and do that so it doesn't get lost in the crowd. Variation. Black border. Normal border. So pretty cool. We have Adam Jones, Team Heroes. Never seen that card before. Joey Votto and Joe Sewell. So we'll take a variation out of that guy. 
All right, so that was it for our packs. Uh, not huge bangers, but always fun to open. I won't complain. So I really like these packages. Gotta figure out how this works. I'm sure he's got a sealer or something. Very nice and easy to open. This one feels like it's in a top loader, so let's go with autograph. So it looks like it's gonna come out. Yep, so. San Francisco, Kevin Mitchell. What? Kevin Mitchell? This is old school Kevin Mitchell. Like back in the day, Kevin Mitchell. 2015 signature series out of 49. Sticker, but Kevin Mitchell. That's that's pretty cool. Top loader's a little bit rough, but I'll swap that out later. So I dig that. All right, let's see what's in here. This seems a little harder. I'm not sure what to think of it. I know there was some graded cards, but I don't feel like this is a graded card. Miguel Tejada. What? What? Look at that. Out of 40. Archive signature series. Miguel Tejada. That's pretty sweet. This is from 07. And that is a player, like in person auto. How about that? That's my first archive signature series out of 40. Miguel Tejada. How about that? I'll take it. This is one of the continuous series of famous ball players. Each card is with a different tip on inside baseball all right well there you go here's your two hits uh that was a mega blaster from walk off wax and yeah just uh like it a lot uh, and uh thanks for watching let me know if i missed anything i have a couple more boxes of this so look forward to future openings and uh yeah let me know if i missed anything make sure you like click and share and subscribe and have a good evening